Welcome to the Minihost Modular Beta. If you have used Patcher in FL Studio, then Minihost Modular will be immediately familiar to you. Minihost is a standalone VST or audio unit host. It's also a VST or audio unit plugin itself. It will host 32 or 64 bit plugins, and the standalone is also available in 32 or 64 bit. It has modular per plugin piano rolls and is a modular mixing environment itself. Before we get stuck in, I've put a link to the Minihost modular manual in the video information and recommend you consult it for more details. So after installing the beta, let's get it set up. Select File, Preferences, and then on the Audio MIDI tab, select your audio device type and then Driver. Select a MIDI input device if you have one connected. Then on the Plugins tab, select Scan and Verify. Now browse to the location of your plugins and click OK and the scan will start. Now to add a plugin, you just right click on the graph window and select Add Plugin. Now the first time you add a plugin, the thumbnail will be blank. Minihost Modular will automatically create this thumbnail the first time you open a plugin. Double click on a plugin module to open the interface. To change the volume of a link, mouse over the center arrow until the volume control appears and then click and drag to change the level. To make connections, you drag on and off target nodes. You can also right click nodes and plugins to work with connections. Cyan or green is MIDI, yellow is audio, and red is automation, as we'll see in a moment. Piano rolls in Minihost Modular are independent modules. You can add as many as you like to the graph, and they can even feed each other. Right click the main graph area to add a piano roll. I'll connect it to Harma and double click to open. So let's add some notes. You can play the piano roll from here. Or you can trigger it externally. So now it acts like a programmable arpeggiator. I'll just add effector to the chain. Now you can set the playback range of a piano module by dragging on the zone limits like this. Now the piano roll will play only for the selected zone. You can also add graph modules within modules. Double click to enter. I'll add harmless and link it to the inputs and outputs. Click along the top of the main graph to change the module you're working with. So now we have one piano roll driving both plugins. Okay, so what about automation? If you look at a piano roll, you will see the automation area down the bottom here. The target is selected from the menu on the lower left. What shows depends on what has been linked. So let's first link the filter cutoff on Harma to the piano roll. Notice the new red automation node for the filter. Now we can connect the two and select the filter cutoff from the automation editor in the piano roll module. And finally, working with Minihost Modular as a plugin is basically the same. That's the basics of working with Minihost Modular. Please check the video information for links to the beta download and the manual. Enjoy!